Hey, dudes. I wanted to shoot a little video. I'm gonna try to tackle the transmission main shaft seal that's been leaking forever on this thing. And so I got the battery out. I unscrewed the starter from the other side because the inner primary is gonna come off. What I wanted to show is how I take this compensator sprocket off. It's kind of a little trick I have. Two bolts go in here. And then I take a big crescent wrench. And I slip that on there. And this one holds it. And it will actually spin off. It wasn't this easy when I first took it off just a minute ago, but it didn't take too much pressure to take that off. Look at this oil. Jeez. I did that rod up to Death Valley in Nevada in the ghost town, and I think a lot of that dirt's from it. Although I haven't changed this all out in probably three years. This is leaking too, so I need to put the boot on this. Oh, the boot is in there. Oh, it's ripped. That's what's going on. It's ripped. Okay. I'm gonna fix this. Fix that. Um, probably clean up the clutches a little bit. It's been running fine, but it's just time for a general cleaning on this. And like I said, the transmission, it's a transmission seal on the inside. That's been, it just gets ripped up. I don't know why I keep, I've replaced it like three times in one month, it was stupid. But what I hear happens is the, the main shaft from this transmission gets sort of worn out a little bit in the bushing. So I went on eBay and I bought this. Let's see if I have it in there. Ready available. I bought this, um, as you can see, I got all my, my seals here. I bought this. No, don't get kept. There's a seal in here that is like an O-ring that goes on the main shaft inside there. It's here somewhere. It's up either there or it's in my glove, my glove box. Let's see. I think it's in here. <clears throat> it's here somewhere. I know I have it. 